Morgan Lucas, Antron Brown, the next pair in this third qualifying session. Meanwhile, we're at mid-track here with Clay Milliken after the boomer. How tough is it to play catch up on these qualifying sessions? Oh, I mean, it's hard. And, you know, we went down the racetrack for two previous runs. Wasn't what we were looking for, but we win. And, you know, it's, uh, it's a lot of cars here. It's going to be a quick field. And we had her tuned up, and it obviously didn't like it. So we got to go back and look at it and go down a different path. You know, this thing is uh, it's, it's battling us. They tell you what they what they want to do, but we ain't figured out what they're trying to tell us yet. But uh, these cars, are they're just unbelievable, so fast. You know what? It's, it's going to be a, a tough field to get in, but we're going to do our best to do it. And, hey, we set one on fire, but we're going to try to let, set a low ET here in a little while tomorrow. Right. Thank Thanks, you, Clay. guys. Yep. Thank you. Clay Millican always able to keep a good attitude, that's for sure. There is the Brainerd winner, Morgan Lucas, who won in a ball of flame against Doug Coletta, taking on one of only five drivers that have won the U.S. Nationals in two classes. Antron Brown, along with Don Perdome, Kenny Bernstein, Jim Head, and Ed, the ace, McCullough. Three seventy-five seven. How about Morgan Lucas out of a part-time role? <laughs> Aaron Brooks boy turned Mom up and Dad the are loving uh, that. And, it, and it's not a huge surprise because he ran a three seventy-two in the semifinals of Brainerd to get the final before the fireball. They put it all together. When that car stays together, all the cylinders are lit. That car really ran, ran well the last couple of races, and this was uh, it was also right there. Two hundred eighty-seven miles per hour to the eighth. That is a staple of Aaron Brooks. He always runs that big eighth mile speed, and that's where the lapse time comes from. Boy, life is good if you're Morgan Lucas racing right now. Is Richie's going to come up and run for 100 grand in a little bit? That that's got to help. Uh, and that's Mike. That, I think that's what we've been looking for all day here in top fuel, some big numbers like that. Absolutely. I mean, we saw Schumacher run the 376 in the semis, but that didn't count towards qualifying. And on a side note, three of five in the books, Antron Brown is not qualified. <laughs> 